Yo, what's up? This is Blake Wilson from Matt Kiteboarding here today to teach you how to do an air transition. Catching the sunset with Louis Ray. Woo you gotta go around the island to get to the sunset, man. <laughs> Hey, this is Blake Wilson here with Matt Kiteboarding for the weekly Friday video vlog. This week I'm going to teach you how to do a 360 transition where you keep your board on the water. Um, I really like this one because you can make every tack a new trick. So you just basically keep your board on the water and do a little 360 spin as you're making a transition. So this week's been pretty fun and crazy. Not so windy this week. Really been just kind of going out on the boat a lot, going free diving, um, getting out to the islands, doing foil boarding behind the boat, and some wake surfing. Just enjoying the island life and really having a lot of fun. Um, right now I'm just walking to breakfast, getting some food before I gotta go to work. So um, here I've just broken it down into four steps for you because there's not too many complicated things for this one. Um, the first step in this trick is to do like a little 360 spin. So not a back roll or not keeping your board on the water, but just do like a little air 360. So basically send your kite up, just do a little 360 to get used to the feel of spinning around the bar and just uh, kind of swiveling around your lines. And then step number two, I've already done a trick tip video for this one, so I don't have to go into too much detail, but is just do a air transition where you ride one way and you jump and you go the other way and then just practice doing those so that you get low. Step number three, as you spin around like this, you're gonna try and stay on the water, but you want to keep one foot, your back foot on the water and your front knee up. So kind of takes the front of your board out of the water and then spins around the nose of the board. So you combine the air transition, the 360 spin that you just practiced, and then you bring one knee up so that the board is kind of angled. So there's a little bit of angle to it so you can swivel around the tail. So you spin around the tail. And then step number four is just sheet out afterwards and pull down on the bar as, you're, as you get your 360 spin. So get your 360 spun around and then right as you're ready to ride, just pull in on the bar, send it down and ride away. Uh, that's a 360 transition and keep your board as low on the water as you can because it's fun to just like have your board spin around on the water without even catching any air. So that's how to do a 360 transition with Blake. Hope that helps and if you have any more requests just let me know.